good morning friends good morning students good morning viewers in this video i am going to explain how to give the figure caption for the drawings for the drawings figure caption for the drawings for the computer aided electrical drawing students for the be third sem students of usman university and for the research scholars or those who are preparing the project reports for their also that is useful figure captions and the figure caption should be below the figure see this is resistor is a resistor is the diagram under that under that you should give the figure caption if it is a table above the table you have to give the figure caption this after figure you give one spacing this 2.1 colon and again you give the spacing then write the figure caption arrow indicate the space arrow indicates the spacing in this figure this 2 is indicates the chapter number and 1 indicates the serial number of the figure for figure captions use font 10 because it should be lesser than the running text the running text will be 12 or 14 like that if it is a 14 the figure caption should be 12 if the figure if the running text is 12 you can you come to 10 font for the figure you should not write the figure caption within the box text box don't use the text box for writing the headers or figure caption and the the here say one example i have given figure 5.3 means 5 is the chapter number and 3 is the serial number of the figure in the same as figure 3.15 indicates 3 is the chapter number and 15 is the serial number of the figure drawing indicator i am also explaining in this video how to draw the indicator uh, inductor sorry i have to draw the inductor see inductor drawing inductor drawing take one arc uh, and draw it okay i will explain this is a up this is a semi circle see this is a semi circle you copy paste the same semi circles here this is upper semi circle this is the second semi circle and it down arc uh, practically i will explain how to draw the inductor then afterwards i will explain you theoretically see this is the word file see this is a word file word file for this i have given the borders also in the previous videos i have explained how to draw the borders you go through that videos so that you may know how to give this borders then later on when you final finalizing the draw, draft you can remove the dra dotted lines for formatting purpose you use when for the thesis also for documentation or drawing any reports also use the borders how to draw the uh, inductor in insert shapes are there using this different shapes you have to draw the any type of diagrams using this lines so i am taking one line see this is my line so i need for drawing arc draw inductor i need one arc see in this basic shapes you are having arc not this is not the semi circle this is arc just click it just click it don't drag it see this yellow symbol make it as a down so that it makes as a semi circle okay this semi circle see i am giving here just copy it right click and copy and paste it here you make it as a side by side and again copy paste copy paste you make it as like this so some curve like this again you can copy see time being i am giving you can you have to take one reference line one reference line so that it is straight or not see this line is i am making zero so that it is straight you adjust it to the tops this reference it is exactly now this is afterwards you remove this line so copy this line this arc and paste it here drag it down here is a command rotating rotating to 90 degrees rotating to and like this flip flop arc we want to flip uh, vertical okay you adjust this arc down arc to second one second one means this this arc not for the first one this second one for second one you adjust this arc one edge left side edge and drag it here drag it to the first one and you adjust this one to the edge 
this is our work okay same thing you copy it don't change the shape just copy it and adjust to the second one only not the first one this is our second arc you adjust to the second arc and then move this third arc to this now it is adjusted see and copy it copy this edge because the same length we need to the other end also copy it and adjust it here okay these are the different types of arcs lines everything now you can remove this and you can also adjust this line to this bottom so that it is equal length now remove it now you can group it because these are the different types of arcs different arcs are there see different lines are there so you make it as a group under home you are having select at the edge select objects and you drag it like this drag it means selecting all the lines see now we have selected everything don't drag like this if, it, if you drag like this these two edges are going you come out of the image and you drag all the tag lines and right click here don't right click in the empty place like right click on the uh, lines so that it will give one plus symbol when it is in the plus symbol you can right click and you can group it now see it is a single object when i am moving with the keyboard up and down or else it is moving now drag it diagonally drag it diagonally to the whatever the size and the shape you need see i want like this you can also make three curves three four anything this is a, my diagram now you make it as a finally you have to after drawing everything see because why i should i am telling this texture wrapping is if you don't give the texture wrapping in line with text it, it will move wherever you move with the cursor this is not correct if it, it should be fixed means say i am keeping in the head this side and i am giving in line with text automatically it moves to the first place of the paper this is the complete diagram and you can you have to give the figure caption for example 2.10 colon inductor inductor this is my figure caption see figure if i am writing full name figure should not give the dot if you write fig dot fig then you have to give dot dot means it is not the complete word you have written something to be right written again that is the dot meaning of that dot if you write fug -E, don't write don't put the dot okay this is the diagram if you want to make the line thickness select the object format shape outlines you can change the line thickness like this anything if you want to make the lack color of the inductor also you can give any type of color this is the line color not this is the line color like this you can draw the diagram you can draw the inductor same thing i have explained in the ppt inductor drawing take one arc and drag to the same drag to make semicircle see what i have shown is same it is arc and i have dragged it to make the semicircle copy and paste same arc i am pasting in the three four places use the rotate option adjust down semicircle this one this semicircle i have adjusted to first one second this second one and the same thing i have given and i have grouped this is down arc with the reference lines also I have got in line with text. This is how to draw the inductor. Thank you very much. In the next video I will explain how to make a two column paper. Thank you. Thank you very much.